we had uh, five jellyfish, adult jellyfish in here in the fall uh, that our kids study invertebrate uh, animals in our fifth grade. And uh, they live between eight and ten months, and so we had them from September, and they were probably four or five months old when we got them. And they lived, I was really surprised, they lived through uh, February of this year. And our last two um, departed at that time. Um, and the kids were kind of disappointed. But then over spring break, about two months later, I came in and I was working on this tank right here and uh, cleaning it. And on the glass, I saw two small baby jellyfish. And then through the process, I was really excited about how did those jellyfish get in here when the adults were down here. Well, as the week progressed, I started looking at the life cycle of a jellyfish, and lo and behold, I found some polyps that I thought at first were sea anemone, which are right along this side right here. And um, in the process of learning about uh, the life cycle of jellyfish, I found that the jellyfish lay eggs, and if I can see some adults, the, or babies, eggs, their larvae that are just hatched, they're just little, they look like little insects crawling on the glass right here. And there are thousands of them as we come across of different sizes in here in the tank. Those larvae turn into the polyps, which are these. The polyps grow and they kind of pile, the, the top of the polyp grow and it's called formating uh, polyps and the very top it looks like uh, its tentacles and the tentacles uh, grow and then very at the very end about two to three weeks later the top pops off and it's a baby jellyfish and we have right now about 40 baby jellyfish upside down jellyfish right here's one and here's a couple that are swimming and uh, another one up here in the top those are small baby jelly, upside down jellyfish and they're called such because they swim upside down, their tentacles go up versus on most jellyfish, they go down. So not only are they in this tank, the adults lay the eggs, went through our whole filter system, they're in the round touch tank, the observation tank, and all these tanks. So we have thousands of baby jellyfish. We are fifth graders did a life cycle of a jellyfish this week. High school students in Lori Isley's class came on over. Uh, four classes and did environmental study and also uh, Mr. Casarelli's zoology class came over because they just finished the life cycle of a jellyfish and studying it and we have it firsthand here in the state of Michigan at Bell Lab.